welcome back to my channel. I'm Sue with Home Study with Sue, and today I'm making some sourdough snickerdoodle cookies that I got off um, the website of Farmhouse on Boone. Um, she's a great person to watch on YouTube. If you haven't already, go check her out. Um, so this bowl has two and three quarters cups of flour in it, two teaspoons of cream of tartar, one teaspoon of baking soda, one and a half cup sugar. And I was supposed to put salt in it, but my butter is not unsalted, so I did not do that. And technically, the butter should be creamed with this butter, the sugar should be creamed with this butter, but I messed up, so I'm hoping that it's gonna go ahead and work correctly with um, the way I did it. And this is one cup of salted butter. Oh, I guess it helps if you turn, if you plug in the Mixer helps a lot. Oh, yes, works much better that way. And I left my butter out overnight to get to room temperature. And it I'm going to go ahead and knock this stuff down. now I would remember to get everything I need before I start videoing, but apparently that's never going to happen. So, I uh, am going to add two eggs. I'm going to mix some more. I'm going to add the two teaspoons of, bake, uh, of vanilla. Along with that, I'm going to add a half a cup of sourdough starter. I already have my onion, my onion, <laughs> ah, that's funny, my oven preheated to 400 degrees and my um, baking uh, cookie sheet that I'm going to use is lined with 
parchment paper. going to slowly add my flour mixture to it. You know, it has the sugar in there because I messed up. Go ahead and put my beater in the sink. Okay, so at this point, 
we um, can either let them sit after we have um, rolled them in the cinnamon and sugar. We can allow them to sit in the bowl um, in the refrigerator to ferment overnight or up to three days. I'm not going to do that step. So what I'm going to do now is you're supposed to roll about one and a half tablespoons of cookie dough in the ball and then roll it into the cinnamon sugar. Seems like an awful big one and a half tablespoon. Seems like an awful big ball, but whatever. I'm not going to make them that big. I'm just going to make them this big. And then I'm going to roll in the cinnamon. And you're supposed to get like 26 to 28 cookies. And the cinnamon and sugar um, is one and a fourth of a cup of sugar and a tablespoon of cinnamon. And we are going to bake them for uh, 10 to 12 minutes. How are you guys doing? Are you all ready for Christmas? I am not. I don't even think about Christmas until after my birthday, which is the 14th, so. The lady um, on Farmhouse for Boone is, um, I'm sorry, Farmhouse on Boone is, uh, her name is Lisa. I watch her every week. She does one video a week. And she does a lot with sourdough and it's, I really like to watch her. I also like to watch her sister, Laura from, um, Uh, or orally house oh 
All right, so I almost got my tray full, so I will wash my hands. Sorry, you have to witness that because I've got sticky hands. I don't want to touch my remote. And then I'll get these in the oven. And I will be back to show you what these look like when they're done. Thank you. All right, so I wanted to show you how nicely these cookies came out. And the one I tasted was very good and my husband liked his. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe, and give me a thumbs up. Thank you.